DIY queen until I DIE. Oh my god, my elf lip oil spilled. I think we can all agree that it is hard to be a woman. Wait, one second. Oh my god, I forgot to fucking make the light pink. Okay. I think we can all agree that it is hard to be a woman. And what's harder than being a woman? Not being a man. Bro, what are you talking about, man? If you think about it the way that I'm trying to explain it. What's actually harder than being a woman? Well, being a woman who wants to look and feel good. Why is that hard, you may be asking? Because looking and feeling good as a woman gets you and Just kidding, oh my god, that's not the route we're trying to go down right now. Feeling and looking good as a woman makes you narcissistic. No, 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 not that, not down that route either. Looking and feeling good as a woman makes you a whole No, not that route, not that route. Looking and feeling good as a woman makes things easier because you get privilege that men don't have. What? Oh my God, Amanda, you're being so fucking controversial right now. Looking and feeling good as a woman is fucking expensive. And that's why it's hard to be a woman. Oh my God, the pink lamp in the background is so cute. Like, tell me I didn't eat. Like, the pink in the pink. <laughs> the point. Where the fuck is the point at? What is the point, you might be asking, right? Do I even know the point? What is the point? It costs to live like this. <laughs> There's a lot that goes into, you know, the beauty of a woman, you know? I can feel naturally pretty. Some things just make a girl feel elevated, powerful. One of those things is self-care. Glow ups, like girls just like to feel pretty and like pamper themselves. So today I'm gonna be doing a $400 glow up. If you think I'm spending that shit, by the way, you're, you're playing yourself. If you came to watch the wrong bitch, you know who you clicked on. Unless it was an accident, then hey girl. I'm basically gonna do this on myself. So we're gonna be doing my lashes. I'm not wearing eyelash extensions recently, so we're gonna be doing a lash lift and tint. We're still keeping it natural, but still, that's some money you gotta spend. Eyelash extensions can range from like 100 to 150. Just, like saying that out loud is so crazy to me. But I used to drop that shit like it was nothing. Like here's a hundred on my lashes. Get to work. You got your money. He got money. Get it all. I'll do it again. The way it makes you feel, the way it makes you look is 100% worth it. A lash lift isn't too far off. Like I've spent from 80 to $115 on a lash lift and tent. But it also depends your state because like I live in Miami, so obviously everything's gonna be a little bit more elevated in price. I was looking at my area and lash lifts are usually 105 around there with the tent. With the tent. If I go blind. <laughs> Limey's girly, if you're watching this, please, please do not be mad at me. She's my friend that does lashes and she was supposed to do my lashes literally today. Literally last week was something happened that like we couldn't. But today she was supposed to do them and I just decided to take matters into my own hands. Lash lift and tint. <laughs> I already cleaned my lashes, but I'm just gonna go ahead and use like the actual thing that it brings to clean them. I miss you. I love you. I've been this RV. No heat. Together for I'm gonna go ahead and leave it for 15. Shut the fuck up, bro. Like, what was what was the purpose of that? I'm already on step two with perm um solution, I guess. Together for eight years, we don't need speak. You know what I miss you, I'll be watching you right through the tree. I've been missing the kids late. Take a hill. Can I come see you later? Okay, I officially have the tint on. It kinda looks like I have a lazy eye right now. This is how it's looking. I'm just gonna try to cleanse it off. The fact that I have my whole other eye to do is crazy. Like lashes and tints are definitely so much quicker. It's not your natural lash, which is a little bit annoying. <laughs> okay. Okay, you guys, I did it. Oh my God. This is obviously the not lifted and this is the lifted lash. And these are my lashes. Um, They're low-key kind of short. Uh, let me do the other eye and I will show you guys. So I'm done with the second eye. Like this has been a very long process, but to be fair, I cannot do my both eyes like at the same time. Like imagine me with both eyes closed trying to do this. Yeah, fucking right. And this is how it looks like on the pad. I think next time I could probably do a little less curly. Like I feel like they're low key very curly right now. 15 more minutes. Look at the lashes. Wow. I'm also going to be waxing my eyebrows, which usually can range from 10 to 25. I've paid 25 just like I've paid $7. I don't think the $7 options exist no more. The way our economy is headed, 
that i can't do myself i'm not gonna lie i really can't i really can't do it myself but this is just to show you guys like that you can switch it up like you can do some things yourself you can go other places for other things like just get on your zoom bro get on your zoom learn how to do your own stuff you don't gotta drop a bag to look like a baddie I kind of want a tan and I haven't been able to get a tan. It's not cute. It's not fun. Not a good time for real. I've seen that tans range from like 50 to 100. Let's this is the before. Do you see a difference? After. Nails, $50. I usually just do a regular dip set. Sometimes I'll add tips. I just don't have the time or the patience anymore to go to a salon and just sit there without my hands. Like, especially when I can do it myself. Like I've recently taken that into like more of a self-care thing like i'll watch a cute little podcast during or like whatever dude like it's me time and it's so much fun i have my little nail kit my caboodle all the things i'm a diy girly for real you know what i'm saying i'm not i don't even know how much nails cost these days it's been forever but i was looking it up and it apparently says that it's like 50 dollars, which i don't believe i feel like it's a lot more i feel like i used to pay that back in the day which means ain't no way a full dip set and manicure is costing $50. Like, I just don't believe it. I, for one, love me an Ariana Grande nail. A little French almond, like, cute. Cute and girly with my, with my like, hand tats. I love me an Ariana Grande nail. But it's a lot of work to do myself. Like, not feeling it. Not in the mood. <laughs> are you calling me lazy? I will beat your ass. I don't care who you are. All my mama. Just kidding. I got my caboodle. My caboodle itself, including everything that's inside, was probably less than 30. You know how many sets I've gotten from this? Caboodle? Caboodle tour. <laughs> I have all of my things here. I have mad colors. Obviously, I do all the salon steps, right? Like, I'm going to cut my nails. I'm going to file my nails. I'm going to take off the cuticle, all those good things. I do have my little thing for that. Right, so I got my tips on. I'm going to cut them down a little bit because I like a shorter almond. Um, now, I'm just trying to figure out what color I want to do. Should I surprise you? Should it be a surprise? They're shorter now and that probably looks so ugly, but just trust the process, please. My nails are done. Done as hell. This is what they look like. I feel like I, with tip and everything, like the fact that I put tips, I feel like this would have been no less than $85. If I'm wrong, let me know I'm wrong. A blowout is like $50 right there. We're gonna be doing that. I haven't been to the salon in a minute either. I'm gonna do it myself because no, y'all not gonna get me. DIY queen till I die. DIY queen until I die. <laughs> that was good, huh? I was doing my research on blowouts. I do not want to blow dry my hair. I have been taking care of my curly hair, my wavy hair, okay, my natural hair. I only want to apply heat like that, like forced heat like that, on special occasions. I was doing my research. A blowout on straight hair in this specific salon, it probably is different for other places, but this specific salon near me, a blowout for straight hair is $35. A blowout for anything besides straight hair, Starts at $95. My hair is not straight, that's for one, but it's not super thick and it's not curly. So let's say that my starting base is $95. I'm literally just gonna diffuse my hair, so let's do it. I miss you, I love you, I've been in this army. No heat, together for eight years, we don't even speak. You know what I miss you, I've been watching you right through the tree. I've been missing the kids, they take it out. Can I come see a lady, huh? Can you guys see me real? Or is it another video? Or should we just have a stadium? That is my version of a blowout. Hey, honestly, I had to take the safe route, guys. I'm so sorry. I could have done like a regular, like, blowout salon blowout but no it's not curly and it's not straight and it's not wavy either like it's like Argh. and i just wanted to throw these other two in here just for funsies just because these are other things that like i like to diy recently <laughs> jewelry i've been making my own jewelry recently dude it's crazy what you do when you put your mind to it tell me that's not fire tell me that's not fire it's fire not to toot my own horn but to tell <laughs> also tattoos in my day, <laughs> I say that shit like I'm 40 years old. Bro. Back in my day, when the youngins were youngins, this tattoo right here, I'm not flicking you off, no, no, no. My Taurus was $40. Little itty bitty tattoo right here. Check this, check this one out. Okay. A few months ago, I went to get tatted, right? Got this heart, this 1111, this moon, these like reefs right here on my pinky. Faded, faded. Faded. I don't know how much I paid for those three tattoos. Four tattoos for those four tattoos and i want you to take i want you to comment down below what you think it was i paid 280 
They faded. They came off like it was damn near a scab. No respect for my wallet. They just clean off like it was nothing. That's money I'll never get back. In this video, I'm gonna be tattooing myself because <laughs> I'm not playing these fucking games no more. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. Oh my god, I'm so joking. Anyways. <laughs> Oh, I can't cover this hand because I'm gonna tattoo myself. Ah! What a cool story though, right? Like, oh yeah, I tattooed myself. Like, that's badass as fuck. And I saved myself 150 bucks. This is crazy, okay. I did it. I did it. I was a little shaky just because it's my finger. There's my heart, guys. That's about a $50 tat. Okay, y'all, so that was it for this video. So that was my whole POV, you're a DIY girly. I am such a DIY girly, bro. I'd rather spend my money on anything else and like do my beauty myself. And then I get a bang for my buck. And I can spend all that money on clothes. I can save that money. I can save that money and build for my future. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you whenever I see you. Bye.